Hello friends, welcome to part 3 of Children Bedroom Design by Keyframes Online. I am Abhishek Inamdar. I'll show you how to design a kid's bedroom in 3D Max with materials, lightings and everything. So let's get started. We have designed, previous two parts we have designed the bed, the ladder, the center table, uh, chairs and storage. So if you have missed the parts please go and see uh, check those uh, parts of my tutorial you will get to know everything about it and now we'll continue the window part I'll just see how much space we have left for the window practically it's not possible to place a window on the side but generally uh, windows are there uh, beside your bed so it gives a nice light to reading books and everything to do activities to do study and I'll just shift like this I'll crunch this thing like this so I'll have some space to get a window I'll just move my camera like this so I have a scope to show my window Now I'll show a window like this. I'll take a simple box. I'll go and left. I'll have this much area. I'll take like this. The, this line I'll match. I'll give a height so it's like this I'll set the wall I'll go to boolean compound objects pick boolean I'll say pick up and B done now I'll sh I want to show the horizontal blinds for this kids bedroom I'll go and left viewport. I'll take one box. Slightly bigger. Like this. Like this. and I'll make a duplicate copy of it lessen the heights of the blinds and maybe like this now I'm making a duplicate copy of it so make sure you do instance you don't do copy why I'm doing instance the difference between the 3d max will not calculate the each and every object while rendering so if you get an instance so it will uh, reduce the rendering time so I'll say 25 fine half open it's looking nice some more one more I can fit over here like this I'll make a group of it group I'll say horizontal lines lines now I can save this thing uh, I can I want to hide this thing now I'll make a frame I'll take a line I'll 
I'll go to extended spline. I'll just take a channel. I'll off the snap tool. Left uh, channel. Take a channel like this. I want to select only spline, so I click on shapes. I select here shapes. <coughs> I'll go to compound objects. I'll say loft. Get shape. Where is the shape? Yeah. Uh, I want the shape should be. small so I'll yes this looks very good this looks even better Select this one. Now we can fit. I can hide this one, hide, shape this one. Window, window adjust, save, hide selection. Now I'll unhide my unhide my uh, my horizontal lines. So this one is looking fine now. I'll make some storage on this side or maybe on this side this side you can access from here this side and I'll make I'll make storage over here and make some uh, other uh, maybe uh, hangers or placement like this I'll make a storage with very simple box spline rectangle Press control on keyboard, it will be give your proper cubicle. Convert to variable spline. I'll go to spline. I'll get outline two inches, something like this. I'll say extrude. can place some books, some toys <clears throat> now I'll make some arrangement on left hand side still I have very less space over here so I'll make it over here I'll take a rectangle Convert to a little spline. Smooth my corners. I'll take a corner and I'll say feel it. Now I'll add one vertex that is go to refine. Click on vertex. Again, I'm going to refine click 
vertex like this line properly this line still I want to cover this one so like this will be fine I'll take one cylinder or uh, sphere auto grid on Thirty two doesn't require this much is fine, or maybe eighteen also fine, like this, like this. Fine. So I can place hangers and t shirts or something like this over here. Now I'll add some books and novelty stuffs in my scene. So by next part, I'll continue the books and all those things. So uh, if you have any doubts in entire tutorial, maybe part one, part two, or part three, of course you can ask me in my comment comment box. And if you like my tutorial, do subscribe my channel. That is Keyframes Online. And meet you in uh, next part.